Ghost Studio with Doodles. With, of course, me, AMIC. Oh, do we have a super episode show for you? Number 26. And this episode is for Thomas Larson. Thomas Larson, are you out there? Thomas, I've heard, I heard you, I heard you. <laughs> I heard you. And yes, today is about none other than dun 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 Emmett Brakowski from the legend Lego legend. I can't talk today. From the Lego movie fame. Emmett's backstory. So he's a construction worker who works on a construction site as an instruction worker on a construction site in the city of Bricksburg, which is hilarious. Uh, wow, all this Lego talk got me a little chilly. Woo! It's... It's... Beautiful day in the studio. A beautiful day to make a doodle. Would you doodle? Could you doodle? Won't you doodle with me? And Emmett Brakowski. Wow! So he is a minifigure released in 2014. He's a good guy in the Lego My Ego movie. And he is voiced by Chris Pratt. So, Thomas, thank you so much for the request. Um, I can't wait to draw Emmett. And I can't wait to see all of your drawings, boys and girls. It's Friday! Enjoy your weekend soon, because it's Friday. All right, welcome back, boys and girls. Oh, wow, the Lego movie. I never saw it, but... I heard that it was really, really funny. I think I saw the commercial um, with the Batman part when Batman, Lego Batman. Well, um, I guess, thanks to Thomas, I'm going to actually watch it this weekend. All right. So now, Emmett. Emmett, we're going to start with, again, the bottom of my paper, the top of my paper, and the sides. So when you're drawing, just really think about, be mindful of um, the parameters, you know, don't don't start his head here, you know. Let's let's always try to start um, in the middle. Okay, so I am gonna start with the bottom of um, Emmett's Lego head. Okay, Emmett's Lego head, and all it's gonna be is gonna be. I am laser focused. Um, it's going to be a big U. Take your time, draw your line. Take your time, draw your line. We're not in a rush. We don't have to go anywhere. Out, since um, we really can't go anywhere. <laughs> so, um, we're not in a rush. Now, um, Emmett has like this really cool hair. Um, it's a little, um, this, this, this plastic molded hair. So, I am going to do... A little curve up and that's gonna be Emmett's sideburn. I'm gonna do it again. Let's do it both sides. Let's do both sides so we could get a better um, a better look at what we're drawing. And then I'm gonna do a big curve just like that. Okay? Easy peasy. Now Again, it's all about connections. I'm just going to make this big curve. Right now, it's all about curves. And watch. I'm going to go bump. And I'm going to connect it. And I made a little bump. I connect it. And then I'm going to finish this off. Bump. So what we just did right here, boys and girls, we made Emmett's hair. We made his hair. Um, and he has, he has like Mr. Miko's hair. He has really nice, like luxurious, thick hair, it looks like. So I'm going to do some... Um, accents um, pieces. I'm gonna smick that look. I'm gonna show you what I just did. Alright. What that does now, it gives it an accent saying, hey, his hair has layers. There's his hair is really thick. 
you know? It has depth, it has dimension to it. And again, it doesn't matter however you feel that you wanna draw these lines. Um, these are just showing detail, okay? These are just showing detail in Emmett's hair. Um, Emmett's mouth, Emmett is smiling. Again, U-shape, U-shape. We have a big U-shape. So we are, are um, associating lines with letters, all right? So how many of you saw the Lego movie out there, boys and girls? So in the comments, um, I love to get comments and a lot of people have been sending me comments on my YouTube page. So send me comments. Who is your favorite character in the Lego movie? Or um, who would you love for Mr. Amico to doodle next? All right. And again, another little curve for the mouth. And I am going to do a curve for the teeth. Wow. Look at that. All curves, all curves, all day, all night. Where the corners of the mouth are, I'm gonna do a little circle. For Emmett's eye, a circle for Emmett's eye. <laughs> oh, I love it when a plan comes together. You yeah, B.A. Baracus, pity the fool. Okay, so now I am gonna do a little, a little tiny shape for his eyebrow. A little tiny rectangle for his eyebrow. Wow, Emmett's face is complete. This is so cool. Um, neck, straight line. His neck is a simple rectangle. Come on, we got this. We got this. Now we're gonna be like building, we're gonna be building blocks, Legos. Uh -huh. We're gonna be building Legos. Watch, rectangle. Then below it is a thinner rectangle. Think of Legos, block by block, step by step, we are creating, we are drawing this picture, this doodle. Connect it, triangle. Wow, we all could do that. I know you can. I know all my moms and dads and grandmas out there. Um, Kylie, I saw Kylie's Earth um, drawing. I saw Kylie's SpongeBob drawing. Excellent job, keep it up, keep up the great work. Okay. And we're gonna put a little curve here. And this is just a little detail that's with Emmett's um, shirt. Okay, just a little detail. Okay, now, a little line here coming off the rectangle. His body is a trapezoid. His body is a trapezoid. It's short line here, big line here, kind of like a triangle. And I'm gonna go on a slant. Watch this. Laser focus, super focus. Laser focus, super focus. Laser focus, super focus. Done. Now I'm gonna take a breath. Laser focus, super focus. Laser focus, super focus. Laser focus, super focus. Done. Take a breath. Wow, before you know it, you're gonna have your whole drawing done. And we're gonna connect the bottom, okay? If you think of art as just a bunch of connections, then you are gonna be the happiest artist ever. You will. You will definitely be the happiest artist ever, okay? Um, line from the triangle. Bam, Dunzo. Woo! We are looking good, Emmett. Okay. So now, 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 now. Thomas, I hope you're having a good time drawing Emmett here. Um, as you know, every time I get requests, I have to Wikipedia or Brickopedia, <laughs> Brickopedia, um, the character, so I understand who they are and what I'm, what I'm drawing. It's crazy, right? So, his arm um, curve, and it's gonna come down to a point. That's where his elbow is. Um, we're gonna do the um, other side too, curve and come down to a point. Okay, excellent. Um, now, slant and cut in. Slant and cut in. One thing about Legos, they're like super expensive. Wow, wow. Um, wow, my buddy, my buddy MCY 
aka Aunt McGrin. He um he got my girls for their birthday. They got them Legos. They got them um a Frozen Lego set. Frozen and um I think it was Beauty and the Beast. The girls went bonkers. They loved them so much. But then we wind up having to put it together for them, <laughs> which was crazy. And we wound up stepping on them. Yes, that's never good. So now, um, slanted line, slanted line. This is going to be where um, Emmett's hands are. Slanted line, slanted line. Okay. Right now, this right here, these are the shadows of the shirt. The shadows of the shirt. The shadows of the shirt. Emmett's hands are curved. Watch this. Look how cool this is. Um, it looks like a big magnet or a lowercase n or a circle that isn't finished. Watch this. Come to a little curve. To a little curve. Wow. How cool is that? His little Lego hand. All right. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. All right, look how cool that is. Wow, this is so fascinating. So now, Emmett has a little belt. Let's draw that belt again. Rectangle, rectangle, trapezoids on top. The rectangle's a little smaller and it goes right across. Okay, rectangle right across. Um, now, we're gonna do his legs. He has a belt buckle. We're gonna put a circle inside. I know it's not a circle in real life, but we're gonna real life. <laughs> Legos aren't real. <laughs> um, I'm gonna put a little belt buckle. I'm gonna put um, little rectangles for squares. Sorry, rectangles for um, the illusion of a belt. Rectangles for squares. That made absolutely zero sense. So. From the rectangle, I'm gonna do a long rectangle. Excellent, okay. I'm gonna do a line coming right off that rectangle. I'm gonna put a line coming off that rectangle. And it goes up to his belt, right? Look at that, we're creating his legs. I'm gonna draw a line going straight down, a line going straight down, okay. Okay, um, a line going straight down, but stopping straight down and stopping. Okay, you see that? These lines are longer, this line is shorter. This goes in, this comes in, all right? And then that comes out. The boys and girls, what you did right now, you just made Emmett's and makes his feet, his legs. And then we're gonna make a little line here. Yes, just to show that his feet are sticking out. His feet are sticking out. Um, Emmett is a construction worker. Um, he is a construction worker. Um, he works on a construction site as an instruction worker. So I think that was like a little funny joke they're trying to make. He's, he's a construction worker who works on the site as an instruction worker. Okay, in Bricksburg, I like that. Um, here's a reflector, a reflector, a reflector on his uniform. There's a reflector. Again, simple rectangles, okay? Um, he has his name badge. It's a big rectangle, a little square, and I'm just gonna do two rectangles inside. That's it, because our space is so small, you really don't have to, um, you don't have to put that much detail into it. Okay, so Emmett, how are we feeling? We're feeling so good. Thank you, Mr. Doodle Dude. All right, call me Doodle Dude, that's awesome. Um, now, I'm gonna make his outfit. His outfit is gonna be, watch this. From the V, from the corner, make a triangle, make a triangle. Bam. Make a rectangle. Make a rectangle. Bam! Repeat again. Make a rectangle.
make a rectangle. Bam! Make a rectangle. Make a rectangle. Bam! Make a straight line going across. Okay. So now on Emmett's construction outfit, he does have a pocket and it's, a, I think it's a see-through pocket. It's kind of odd. And another see-through pocket. And then he has a kind of like a pen. So this, yeah, let's just do it like that. It's fine. So watch this. So simply, let's do this. Line up over. Looks like a little city. That's it. That's it. That's going to give the illusion of a skyline. The illusion of a skyline. Up. The illusion of a skyline. Again, use any shapes you want. Anything you want. This is your world. This is your drawing. You own it. Your experience, that's all I care about. I care that you are having a fun time, that you are gaining confidence, and you are appreciating, appreciating the fact that you can draw, that you have the time to t draw with me. That's what people don't realize sometimes. Just appreciate the time that we share. Um, and then we're gonna do, let's do, let's do, oh, let's do this. Let's do some lines like Keith Haring. All right, watch this. That's going to be cool. All right, just to show how important um, Emmett is. Just how how important is Emmett, okay? How important is Emmett? And then we will put a line like that. And maybe he's on, maybe he's on a dock. Maybe, maybe his construction site is near the water, all right? Maybe it's near the water. And I'm gonna do wave it, wave it, wave it, wave it, wave it, wave it, whoop! 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 Wave it, wave it, whoop, 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 whoop! We are done! And make the Lego Man! All right, boys and girls, so exciting! Roll call! Call in all colors, call in all colors! We got orange, red, green, purple. We got brown, we got yellow, we got blue, we got black today. All right, also, Remember, um, colored pencils work really well on crayon. Do the crayon first and then put the colored pencil on top. Okay, so Emmett is wearing an orange construction outfit. Let's start to fill that in. I have my orange again. Please use any color you want. You deserve it. You deserve to be as creative as you can. Um, and I am gonna just, again, um, I did not heat these up, Mr. Ennis. <laughs> Mr. Ennis, do you heat up your crayons? No, I don't heat up my crayons. What do you think? It's, it's not a gluten-free mac and cheese from Amy's. <laughs> oh, I have to go food shopping. Oh, I have to go food shopping. I can't. I can't wait. It's going to be so fun. Okay. So, as I am adding in the orange, if you noticed... I'm skipping each one because that's going to be his outfit. So there are so many variations of Emmett's, um, what Emmett is. There is normal Emmett. There's hard hat Emmett. There's tracking device Emmett. There is robot disguise Emmett. There is Western Emmett or Western omelet. <laughs> there is a master builder Emmett. Um, an after apocalypse Emmett. So, after I read that, I was like, hmm, what exactly is after apocalypse Emmett? So, I checked it out. And guess what? As I am finishing again, 
apply the pressure that you feel that you need for your um, for your coloring. And the coloring is the most important part. Again, you want to feel confident and accomplished. All right. So you ready for this? His variation of After Apocalypse Emmett. And then I'm going to do the leg is going to be um, the big rectangle is going to be orange. Okay. And the next one's going to be orange. And then the reflector. And then this is going to be orange. Okay. I just want to show you that, boys and girls. All right. And then I'm going to skip the next one. I'm going to go to this big one. I'm going to show you what's going to happen with this one. Um, I'm going to take a little bit of black. Because now we want to make it look like, kind of look like it's three-dimensional. All right. We put a little bit of black and then we put orange back on top. So now look how cool that looks. It looks like kind of his foot is like sticking forward. All right. So, and then I'm going to do the same coloring on the other side. Um, five years later, after Bricksburg was destroyed <laughs> by the Lego Duplo aliens on Taco Tuesday. So, these aliens came down and destroyed Bricksburg on Taco Tuesday. How insane is that? They, had, they, they couldn't pick any other day, right? So Taco Tuesday, um, Emmett's construction clothes were um, slightly ripped up. And that's basically the information I got about his um, variation of After Apocalypse Emmett. <laughs> I don't know. I got to tell you the truth. I crack myself up with this stuff. This is funny. This is this is good stuff. This is you know this is like chicken chicken soup for the heart or chicken soup for the soul or chicken soup for the I don't know, for the elbow. Okay, so now all my orange is done. Um, I'm gonna go into blue. I'm gonna take the blue, and I'm gonna do his arm. Okay, he has this really cool um you know he has his construction uniform on, and it's not slightly ripped. This is before the apocalypse. And again, I am going, I'm going to, ah, look at that, look at that. And the V-neck on top is blue. Um, the beauty about these videos, so this is episode 26. So we have a lot of people who, you know, over the weekends, they love it. They're like, oh, Mr. They're like, man, don't Mr. Amico. They're like, um, I did like six drawings. And then they take a break for a week and they come back. And that's the beauty of this. That's real deal beauty of this is that take a break do your drawings do them at your leisure do them when you want to do them and i'm going to take gray um i'm going to do gray right above the v-neck right um right 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 where right his lego head goes into and that's that's legit the beauty of this these videos are here for you they're there for you from when you need to take that break when you need to escape, when mom, dad, grandma, cousin Jimmy, um, your dog, when they need a break themselves. Again, hug your parents, love your parents, appreciate your parents. Give them a break and you know what? Park them in front of Mr. Amico. It's better than playing video games and you know, they get to draw, they get to be creative. Oh, I remember when I was a kid, I just loved, I would give anything just to sit down. I, I, that's what I do now. I doodle, I draw, I have drawing books. And every night I make sure that right before I go to bed, I give myself an hour. I give myself an hour and I draw. And I draw in my drawing book. All right. And it just, it's the best stress reliever ever okay i pick a theme and i just draw i just draw and draw and draw and then when i'm done when that hour is up i'm disciplined to say hey you know what i could come back to it tomorrow i close my book and i have my special pens and i close my special pens and i go to bed and i go to bed happy and i go to bed 
feeling accomplished because I I carved out a little bit of time for myself during during the day. And I'm gonna take some black. I'm gonna put the black. Um, I'm gonna put the black right there where the arms were. Remember that? That's just gonna give it a really cool shadow. Look at that. Bam. Bam. So it really looks like his arm, you know, he was really using his arm. Keeping with that blue, he has a pen in his pocket. I'm really glad, really glad that Thomas brought this character to my attention. Um, I love taking all your requests because you are, it keeps us, it keeps us so much more connected because I am drawing for you. I am doing this for you. So, if you tell me what you like, then that makes the connection so much stronger. If I draw what I like, what kind of connection does that make? Um, his eyes are gonna be black and his eyebrow. So please, like, you think I would have ever picked a, a, a Lego or um, what do we have? We had Legos. We had Mario. I remember Vera wanted Mario. I never thought, I just never thought of doing Mario, but I love it that you are guys are giving me requests. So, um, let me get some brown for his hair. So when the video is over, click like. Click that you like the video. All right, mom and dad, click that you like the video. And then write Mr. Miko a comment. Say, hey, Mr. Miko, can you draw this for me? And I will get right back to you and I will respond to you and I will say, yes, of course, of course. All right. We are all lined up now. We're lined up with such awesome requests from such awesome kids. And every kid, every boy and girl that is drawing with Mr. Amico, every boy and girl that's just drawing in general, they are, they are the bee's knees in my book. Um, I'm going to take black, and the black is going to be right here for the highlight. Okay, you guys are number one in my book. All right. Seriously. There's nothing better. There is nothing better than this being able to be creative in your own way. And we're all creative. If you can't be creative this way, which I think you can, you could be creative in another way. Maybe baking. Oh, maybe, um, maybe dancing. Maybe dancing's your outlet. Okay? Um, we all have so many outlets. We just, we just have to know how to use them and when to use them or see how other people can, um, take advantage of them. Okay? Like you guys, like how you guys are taking advantage of um, this time we share. So right now I'm going to take a light black and I'm going to do my first building. Now again, super soft, super, super soft pressure. Okay. Let me hear you say that at home. Super soft pressure. All right. And again, if you do have color pencils, um, you can always Put your color pencils on top. I'll give you an example. So right now, I'm gonna have to take this purple blue color pencil and watch this. It is so creamy. These are, let's see, these are Prismacolor. All right, these are Prismacolor Premium. And what happens now, the Prismacolor, all it's doing is filling in all of the negative space that the crayon missed. That's all it's doing. Um, and it's really, really giving a really cool effect. So if you have colored pencils, um, if you need colored pencils, um, get colored pencils. But again, use whatever you can. Um, and I'm gonna do the other side too, okay? I'm gonna do the other side too. Yeah, so think about what you bring to the table because everyone is super special out there, everyone. Um, I see Inez, Inez is making her drawings every day. Every day she posts. Um, and I get to see the drawings. I get to see the, how, the happiness in each drawing. And each drawing brings me happiness that I see. Um, and King Vincent and Angelina. Um, so just, just keep on. Riona, Riona's out there. Riona, um, Hasato, they are 
every, it's like every day, like, bam, it's like clockwork. They can't wait to do these drawings and I can't wait to look at them and give them a beautiful comment, all right? Just a beautiful comment. Because again, family makes life beautiful, all right? Material items don't make life beautiful. They make life ugly. Family makes life beautiful. Real love, pure love makes life beautiful. Okay, it's like, it's like a puppy. Like, I always think of, of a puppy, of a dog. Uh, my dog, Teddy. And no matter what, he would bark and be the happiest little thing when he saw you. And he would jump in your arms. And that's, and that's, that's real love. That's real love right there. So always think of how a puppy, how would a puppy um, feel? Or how would a puppy treat you? And now I'm going to just do some, um, I'm going to do some light yellow, but every other one. All right. I'm doing light yellow because I don't want to interfere with his face. So really light. And every other one, really light. All right. And right now, during this pandemic, doggies all have homes. So all the shelters are empty, which again, oh, puts such, such a big smile on my face. I, I, I think that's, see, there, there, could, there could be great news. There's always great news out there. You just have to seek it. You just have to search for it, all right? There is, there is, um, there is always, um, am I gonna say this right? A silver lining, is that is that how you say it? There's always a silver lining, I guess. All right, so let's see. Anything else about Mr. Um, Mr. Emmett? Um, Wanna hear some quotes? Okay, I got some quotes for you guys. <laughs> I got some quotes. Yes, I did. Good morning, apartment. Good morning, ceiling. Good morning, doorway. Good morning, floor. Ready to start today. So I guess Emmett said that in one of his movies. Um, I'm gonna take a beautiful turquoise now. I'm going to take this beautiful turquoise and I am going to do the water. Oh, this is awesome. I right, hear some more quotes. I don't know, but that beat is pretty fresh. I don't know, but that beat is pretty fresh. <laughs> uh, I can't wait. I cannot wait. I cannot wait to see this movie. Lego movie. I can't wait. I'm going to sit down with Lily and Lucy, but Again, Saturday, we're gonna rent Trolls 2 again. <laughs> Trolls 2. I cannot wait to watch it. I watched it six times already. Yep, you heard me right, six times. And I laugh hysterical every time. Trolls 2, it is worth the $20 because you get it for two days and it beats taking twins <laughs> to the movies. <laughs> Twins, two tickets, twins, two popcorns, twins, two waters. Oh, yeah, so it saves us a lot of money by um by renting the movie and watching it here. And Onward, but we just got Onward from um, Disney Plus, so um, Onward was absolutely fantastic. Well, Grenovere? Gren Grenovere? Gren Gren Grenovere? Grenovere? Grena, Grena something. Okay, so now... He is on a dock, all right? Oh, I think I have a song about that. Something on the dock of the na na na. Miss Spinner, Chris Spinner would know that. Na 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 na, dock of the na 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 na. All right, so check this out. I am filling in, I am filling in. So Miss Winters, Miss Winters, she is a jigsaw puzzle champion and she's a doodle champ. So I do have to, um, I, I do have to text her and see um, if she's been doing her doodles. Um, Eddie and Eddie and Brandon, Eddie and Brandon, yes, they're at it. I right, saw so their SpongeBob's. Wow, wow. I, dad and son, dad and son, just spending spending good quality time together. You know. Uh, and my buddies, Avery and Riley. Oh, those are my buddies. And, and Vera and John Luca, my buddies. And Lizzie. Oh, of course. Of course. Like, these are just these are just regulars that just love it. They just love it. Um, wow. Wow. So now I'm going to just put a little gold here. This is from Tomatoa. Sh 
shiny like a treasure. Wow, wow, wow. I'm so shiny like a la 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 what a great reference. All right, boys and girls, episode 26 in the books. Finito, donezo. Yes, we are done. Oh, again, thank you for opening up your heart, opening up your mind, being creative, and allowing me in, allowing me to spend the time with you. So, hug your parents, love your parents, and most of all, appreciate your parents. And this is, check out this painting. Pretty cool. All right, boys and girls, enjoy the rest of your Friday. Bye.